here's the, the brains of it here as far as the movie. It's on a portable media drive. As a backup, it is also in the computer itself if this didn't work, but I prefer to run it off the media drive. And it's like any other kind of hard, uh, portable hard drive inside of here. It doesn't jam in, so it fits in nicely, so you don't have to uh, manhandle it. I usually set it on top right here, and then on the back. And it doesn't matter which one, I just pick the middle one. But it, it does, doesn't matter, just like anything. I find sometimes, just like even a, a mouse or a, a keyboard, for some reason, if it falls out of connection, you can change USBs. But you know what the, the white light is on? Okay, and it's working well. And I just put the case up here. I try this back in the case here. The remotes you want to use are the two ones that are in the uh, orange slots. You shouldn't need the projector remote because you're not doing anything with the projector, so I would just take the one uh, uh, computer remote. It is noted by looking here. So you've got VCR controls. You got the file folder, which is an important button on here. So the VCR controls and the file folder button are the most important part. You have a backlight button if you wanted to hold that. Okay, so VCR controls and file folder button. Okay, so and the button I want to push here is the file folder button. But push this file folder button. All the files that are recognized: the internal drive, okay, the, the media drive I just plugged into, and the local drive here. So I want to, it's just a navigation through left to right, up and down. So I want to go up into the media drive here, so I can point it here, and it opens up all the files in the media drive. If I go down here to the main root drive, I can scroll through uh, the, what I'm looking for on the, on the other drives. So I want to go up into the Digiterm drive, and in the Digiterm drive, there's all these file folders that I can choose from to watch different movies, okay? All right, so the one I want to look at, the file folder, is the Red Tail, so it's Bill's test file. I go up into the Bill's test file, and here's all the test runs when I was trying to figure out what configuration through our software would work the best. And it's the fourth one here, and I go up into that, and select it, and the movie starts automatically. Okay. The CAF Red Tail Squadron would like one of a kind documentary experience. At times, the images on the screen may overwhelm you. If this happens, close your eyes for a moment, and the scene of... And then you have blind controls on the front of the stereo system. You have a master volume and you have a master volume, and you have a volume for the stereo system that is just that one channel. So you can change the reverb, the bass. And then, so. He didn't want he did. it. He did. The master volume. We're at this meeting, right? This meeting we've been prepping for weeks. And he stands up. It always works. Okay, I'm gonna pause it there, okay? Yeah. Uh, right there. <clears throat> Uh, so you asked about placement. So here's the time you can pause it, and here's the placement. Because it's not the full dome video, and I'll show you that here in two seconds, what I'll do is I pause it right here, and I can back up the camera now, so I, I, need, I, I don't want to, I want to save that space, make more space in front of the unit here. Okay, so we'll do that here in a second. But I just want to go through now. If you watch the movie, just like a VCR, I hit pause, stop, or what have you, you'd use the same VCR controls. And I hit stop, it takes me to the main menu, okay? If you don't mess with it too much, okay, at the end of the video, it'll reset itself back to this scene right here. And all you have to do is hit file folder, hit play, it'll go right back in the movie. If you get out of sequence, you just, once again, it's just like going through a computer file system on, on Microsoft to go to the right file folder or what have you. This give you an idea for the ones that here weren't yesterday. 